Welcome to Hashtag Whiskey and Biz Reviews. Home of the Hashtag Common Sewer. Hashtag Highland Park Distillery. What, what? You excited? Oh yeah. Let's get into it. So today we are featuring the Highland Park Distillery. We're really excited about this. We have the 12 year, the 15 year, and the 18 year old expressions. That's right. And Highland Park comes from Orkney Island, which is actually the only distillery on that island. Right. So let's pop these corks and let's have a tasting. So now that we've uh, tried the 12, Mark, mm -hmm. what do you think of the nose? It's, it's got an extremely balanced nose, and, it, and the balance is between peat and the sweetness. Mm -hmm. Now peat, for some of your con common sewers out there, um, is kind of described as a earthy, smoky style to it. But the sweetness comes in, it's very balanced. What do you think of the, of the I palate? I agree, I agree. What the palate I'd say is uh, very sweet up front. Mm -hmm. um, Reminded me of a, a sticky sweet smoked sandwich, actually. Okay. Yeah. And I thought it was also oily on the palate. Yeah, a little I would bit, agree. Which was nice. It was nice texture. Mm -hmm. On the finish, we get more of that sweetness and that smoke coming through gently. But also, it's got a little bit of a nut and honey right. flavor coming right. through. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So now we're on to the 15. Tell us a little bit about the 15 on the nose as compared to the 12. Okay. Well, with the nose, I definitely got... Um, less peat mm -hmm. than the 12, but uh, it also had a little, a slight sweetness to it. Mm -hmm. uh, it just felt balanced, right. well-rounded, you know? Right. And on the palate, I, you know, the peat does come through really nicely, but it's a, it's a totally different animal than the 12 and the 15, 18. Right. Because this is aged in American oak, which has previously had Oloroso sherry, where, whereas these two, the 12 and the 18, mm -hmm. have been aged in European oak. So that would explain it, but it gives it a very, very smooth, balanced, all the way across the board. What about I agree. the finish? I agree. Well, with the, the finish, I got kind of a, a nutty, creamy flavor, uh, right along, of course, with the, the peat. And right. The, the, and it's just the sweetness. Right. And just for some of you that don't know, peat, when we say peat, it's kind of, it's described as a earthy, kind of smoky style to it that comes through, not as smoky as some of these other whiskeys that you may have heard of like Laphroaig or Lagavulin right. or Ardbeg. So this is a very nice balance between peat and sweet. Mm -hmm. So for the 18 mark, what'd you get on the nose? Honestly, it's, it's, it's in a league of its own compared to even the 12 and the 15 because of I the agree. complexity. Yeah. It's got um, this rich honey flavor with rich fruit coming through right. and then the peat just wants to like sneak in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. For the palate, it was just, I mean, it was amazing. It was really rich and the, the sweet um, like cherry fruit mm -hmm. right on top right. and then that on top of vanilla and then that on top is just the, the peat, the smokiness is just awesome. And then it had me so excited in the finish because there's a new flavor that just pu punched through. Mm -hmm. It was like this charred burnt caramel and then the peat smoke just said, hey, I'm still here. Yeah, this is all an attribute to, to just how many awards this has won, you know? I agree. All right, guys, we're into the wrap-up right now. We just tasted the 12, the 15, and the 18. Sean, how would you start this off? You know what? It's very simple for me. Mm -hmm. um, it's just the 12, it's very uh, just at the heart of Highland Park. Right. You know, you got the peat, and you got the sweetness. And then when you go to the 15, it's, it's a little more complex, and they're actually opening up, and, mm -hmm. they're, and they're showing you that they have a lot more to it. Right. And then when you get to the 18, it's really full, and it's really in your face, and it's really flavorful. So here's where we're at, folks. We've already talked about this. This is where we agree. We're giving these, these uh, whiskeys ratings. We give the Highland Park 12 an 84, which is very good. Right. We give the Highland Park 15 an 86, which is also very good, but oh, just yeah. slightly a little bit more very good. And then we give the Highland Park 18, drum roll, 92, nice. excellent, um, complex, and really an award-winning whiskey. Right. 
Thanks again for joining us for this lineup of the Highland Park Core Expressions. We hope you enjoyed this review. Join us next time for hashtag Whiskey and Biz Reviews. Hashtag Highland Park Rocks. They do. See you soon.